Hi, I'm Dr. Amanda Cohn. I'm a physician and a medical officer in CDC's National Center for Immunization and Respiratory Diseases, and currently serve as the Executive Secretary for the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices, or ACIP. I'd like to share with you how this devoted group of experts develops recommendations and advises CDC on the use of vaccines in our country. ACIP is dedicated to making evidence and science-based recommendations to prevent and control vaccine-preventable diseases like COVID-19. They are motivated by their intention to save lives, are free from political influence, and ensure transparency by holding all of their meetings open to the public and making them available online. The committee is made up of 15 voting members who are medical and public health experts from across the United States, including one person who represents the general public. They review information about the safety and effectiveness of vaccines and clinical trial results, and then vote to recommend whether those vaccines should be used in the United States. The committee also has non-voting members, such as representatives from the American Nurses Association, American Medical Association, American Academy of Pediatrics, and the American College of Physicians. It's important to have these individuals on the committee because they offer the perspective of doctors, nurses, and other healthcare providers who follow CDC's vaccine recommendations and put them into practice. A lot of effort has gone into developing, studying, and authorizing COVID-19 vaccines quickly to respond to the pandemic we are facing. It is understandable that you may be concerned about the safety of COVID-19 vaccines, given how quickly they have been developed. Despite this rapid pace, COVID-19 vaccines go through the same rigorous review process as all other vaccines before this committee votes on whether to recommend them. Vaccine safety is always the top priority, and it is no different for COVID-19 vaccines. Since the beginning of the pandemic, ACIP has met often to stay informed about COVID-19 vaccines. After each COVID-19 vaccine is authorized or approved for use in the United States, ACIP will quickly meet to review available data from the rigorous studies that vaccine manufacturers conducted to show that each vaccine meets safety and effectiveness standards. After discussion and public comment, the committee will vote on whether or not to recommend the vaccine and if so, who should receive it? This is the same process ACIP uses for all vaccines. The same process that has recommended the safe and successful vaccines that protect our communities from diseases that once killed hundreds of thousands each year. It is my sincere hope that hundreds of thousands more lives will be saved with safe vaccines for COVID-19. However, no one tool alone is going to stop the COVID-19 pandemic. For now, your best protection will be a combination of getting a COVID-19 vaccine when it is recommended for you, and then continuing to cover your nose and mouth with a mask, stay at least six feet away from others, and wash your hands often. COVID-19 vaccines will be an important tool to help stop this pandemic. For more information, go to cdc.gov forward slash coronavirus.